To add our document manager plugin to your WordPress installation, go to the plugin manager and search document manager. We're located at the, to at the top, uh, so just click install and activate. Once activated, you can navigate to your documents area. Um, in the settings, you can choose a page which your documents will show up or you can add the short code. Once your page is ready, navigate to your documents area. And this is um, a protected page and it requires login uh, from a WordPress user. All users have access to their own files and the administrator also has access to their files through the uh, admin uploader. It's very simple to add a file. Click Add File, Browse, choose a file, or multiple files, and click Upload. The upload process happens in the background through Ajax, and once uploaded, you'll receive a thank you message, and um, you can view your files. Um, from here you can download or delete. Um, you can refresh the file and we also have an events log to show you who downloaded the file. You can also add folders. and add files to folders as well. There's unlimited nesting um, in the free version, so you can add as many subfolders as you would like. You can also create links and video embeds, and it'll uh, show as a uh, document element in our document manager. Um, you can search for files and um, that's about it for the free version on the front end. Uh, we have a few, a bunch of features actually in the in the premium version. Um, for instance, we have uh, un unlimited file sizing through chunking, um, and you can check out our premium uh, videos on our website. Um, so you can also manage your files in the back end. So you can see we have our couple files here. You can view which user. Um, is connected to that file. You can view your folders, and this this folder is owned by admin, and you can change ownership of that folder. And there are a bunch of settings uh, for you to go through. For instance, uh, mail settings. Um, there's an admin mail, a user mail, um, vendor mail, and uh, there are a bunch of different uh, fine tune settings that you can just change here. Um, if you wish to secure your file area, you can use an alternate uploads folder. I recommend this for any um, websites that are hosting sensitive uh, files. And um, you can do that here. So for instance, you could, you could change that directory to something below web root. Um, along with that, there are a bunch of other settings, and um, you can compare that to premium and um, check out our other add ons on our website. If you go to smartypantsplugins.com, you can view our premium version along with um, all the different add ons we have for the plugin. Um, we have a bunch of different features such as uh, group uploads so you could assign groups to uh, folders, user roles to folders, um, offloading through Amazon uh, storage. Um, if you want an at rest encryption so the file is actually encrypted on your server we have AES file encryption. Um, we have a Dropbox add-on so you can export to Dropbox and Google Drive. Uh, we
we have a form manager which allows you to build forms within the plugin and then allow people to fill out those forms and have it have it added to the document manager as a PDF uh, so there there's a lot of uh, things you can do and a lot of uses for our plugin on your website so uh, if you have any questions just come to smartypantsplugins.com and uh, open up a chat and we are here to help you